This is going to be behind the scenes of the big Finley Magic debut television commercial. Action. All right, what's up everybody? Good morning, welcome to another video. As you can see, spring has sprung. Another beautiful day in paradise here. And today we have something exciting. So we have been, as a complete family, casted into a local commercial for a hardware store in Stone Harbor, New Jersey. So somebody that we know, I should say we're not actors, but we have actually been in a couple of movies. Enterprises Incorporated. Cabling is a private monopoly. One that has never come out yet. And we've also done some acting for other commercials in the area. Welcome to beautiful Cape May County. Don't take a vacation from recycling. Not sure if it's trash or recycling? It's easy. Download the CMC MUA Waste Wizard app we show you so you know it before you throw it. I don't know. We have a script for it. It's just like one page. So it's not very intricate, but we are loading up the car right now. We're going to head out supposed to be there at one o'clock but i know robbie and he is always running late so if we show up a little bit late i think it will be fine sammy j any last words before the tv appearance um i'm excited kind of finley's first time on tv first time yeah. starring finley magic and i brought this polar or this Disposable camera to get some epic pictures of the family in all their beach attire. Well, regular gear, because I got to wear normal clothes today. We just pulled into Stone Harbor, New Jersey. We're about to pull up to the Ace is the place any minute. Where is it? It's on this strip, so like, I'm assuming you can't miss to it. The left. I'm just gonna go straight. I think it's to the right, but you might be right. It could be to the left. I'll stay center. This is a cool town, though, for beach vibes mainly. The Gypsy Inn. Oh, wait, it says the Gypsy Inn. Gypsy Lane. Lane. Yeah. <laughs> Uncle Bill's, they have that. Fred's Tavern. One time I went there before. Like 2008. Probably sooner than that, actually. The polo shop. Like polo clothes? No, it's the No, like actually the game of polo, right? Surfing polo shop. I have no idea. Really I think Ace is, is coming up uh, on one side or the other. How much do you think it would be to rent a space? Ooh. <laughs> to rent one of these stores? Okay, you would. Right. There it is. Right. Seashore oh, Ace. Ace. I see There's the guy. I see him. Alright, how do I like... Whip around and park next to him if you can. Is there a car behind me? Yeah, but you can let him go by first. Is there another car? No. Nah. Look at this guy oh, right here. Had a park. Bean has room, right? To get up. Yeah. There he is, the guy. Hey. What are you doing? I'm gonna do an outside shot. Cause you know you need an outside shot. I was thinking drone, but maybe not. Maybe we'll just go with this. What kind of drone you got? Same one. What is it? I don't even remember. Is Mavic, it the it's a beast? Or two or something like that. It's all right, yeah. I mean, she still flies. I ran it into a, a wall a few times. Got it stuck in the railing at Kensington, but she still flies. I crashed the other drone. I got a new one, but I crashed my other one like 80 times. They and still it still work. works. See, they're not bad. They're tougher. 
check these out. Blue blockers. Oh, I found my pair from the other day. <laughs> Hi, Finley. Hi, Finley. Hello, she's hello. ready for her first TV spot. You got to start sometime. You think she's going to make it to the cut? Oh, yeah. You, no. I figured, you know, we've got these kitchen shots. Holding, holding on and <laughs> she'll be in it. First take Jake out here. First take Jake. <laughs> Little toes, oh my Little goodness. Piece. Little piggies. <laughs> oh, I gotta put her socks on. Take a set up real quick. And do and what? Come back. come back and get you. Unless you wanna come through now, Unless I just know that. I might come through and check it out. Fine. She has her phone. Here's the place, Ace is the place. You guys are gonna see my face on this commercial. Starring. Okay, what you got? All right, we're here on location. Where? Even though it's backwards? Yep, it would be facing the building the shot. Oh, okay, so I... Like, the street. So I think maybe have them coming backwards. I'll go get Scott and let him know what's going on. And... All right, so we're here on location for the television spot. So this commercial is going to be how long do you think? Maybe only like one minute, right? No, 30 seconds. 30 seconds only. Short 30 seconds. 15 hours of growing labor, <laughs> including probably more than that with all the editing and everything so if you look at something on tv and you see like a very intricate commercial the amount of man hours spent on that commercial is probably astronomical for how short it actually is because this is a pretty basic commercial and it's probably still going to take robbie like days and days and days to finish it completely so that's what's crazy about what's on tv is definitely not reality You can leave that here. I'll wait here. You sure? Yeah. Right. I'll bring this up just in case uh, he wants to look at it. You got to go out. Or... All right. The first shot here is going to be us in the car hanging out, like as if we just got here to the Ace Hardware, and they're going to be putting the grill that we ordered online in the back of our car. But the reality is, we're not even actually going to put the grill in. They're just going to have a shot of them about to put it in. What's it looking like? Go this way more? Like this. Uh, so if you, this angle, like that. All right. So pull up and back up. Yes, yeah, so I don't want to get global pursuit in there. Um, he opens it up. Okay. Maybe you could bring the spatula too. Okay. While I'm walking down. Yeah, it'd be like here. And then, uh, then you go. That was easy. That was easy. That was easy. That was, that's the line? Yeah, that's her line. Uh, and, what was easy? Uh, picking up the grill, for you, so it's out of order. Okay, But you guys that's bought I mean. something online, Okay. and then you picked it up for free at the store, okay. and now you're here using it. So, okay. you're like, I want to oh, make sure, easy. that's a specific, that was easy. That was easy. That was easy. Yeah, that right. was easy. Take two. Try again. All right, then let's go. Let's like by the... The, what do you call it? In front of, uh, I'm sorry. All right, here's the shot. Right here. We got the red epic stage. weapon. Him, that was easy. Look at this view from, and, uh, from our, the commercial that we got. And I want to see Backyard is the bay. Beautiful. How do you feel about the commercial so far? Good. <laughs> All I have to say is... As long as Bean's good, I'm good. All I have to say about this TV spot, Robbie, is that was easy. Listen, you're going to be saying that for weeks. I mean, it's, it's, been, it's been five years and I still say our key okay. here uh, does it right. Does it right. <laughs> <laughs> like, All right. Finn's debut. Okay. Finn's debut, debut went off without a... Basically, she's natural. Obvious. It's still going. As you guys know, obviously she's a natural. Come on, baby. But we're going to go through Dude, this. Look. look, Bean, look at this place. A different outfit? Wow. Okay. Now we're going to do the shot. Yes. For this shot. Yeah. Okay, so and I can change her outfit too. Like, come over with, with her, you know? Uh -huh. And then you, like, put your hand on her or whatever, however you feel like doing. And then you're going to be like, well, looks like we need to trim her. It's a mulch. How about? Oh, we need a lawnmower yeah, too. Lawnmower. Yeah. <laughs> this is going to be behind the scenes of the big Finley Magic 
debut television commercial. Action. She is crazy when it comes to jeans stuff, right? She's a production baby, though. <laughs> she is, she is. All right. Let's do this. Let's do it, Bean. Up, uh, put, put Finley right in the middle just for a second. I'm going to use her shirt as a weight balance today. All right. Yeah, pull it back a little bit. Perfect, good. So wait, we need a grill first. Wait, we need, wait, we need a grill. Just wait, we need a grill. Cause okay. yeah, he's like, I can't wait to go to the store this weekend. You guys don't have a grill there. Are and we drinking these coffees? You can drink it, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and you're gonna be like, but we need a grill. You can say, just, we need a grill. However you feel that you wanna say it. But that's what you're gonna order. Okay. Um. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ready? Give it a go. <laughs> All right, and action. Can't wait to go to the shore this weekend. Wait, we need a grill. We do. <laughs> you oversold it. <laughs> Is that it? Yeah, no, I don't you oversold it. Don't do that, yeah. <laughs> oh, wait. You did, yours are perfect. Oh, well, perfect. then you messed it up because I, mean, I don't know if I could do that again. We're going to try. We're going to try that. Uh, yeah, I can't, I can't <laughs> wait. Should I be like looking where? I mean, just like how you guys would normally be in the kitchen. So it'd be like, yeah, you, know, you could look at. I would not <laughs> normally be in the kitchen with this girl. <laughs> I can't wait to go to the shore this weekend. Wait, we need a grill. Good. That was good. That was good. Was it actually good? It was that good. Was it was awkward. Good. Yeah. One more. Hold on. Sure, it's getting better and better by the moment. So has Ben. Yeah, yeah, so has Ben. Yeah. Okay. I can't wait to go to the shore this weekend. Wait. We need a grill. <laughs> I can't hold it. No, it's good. It's good. I'm trying to think. Um, how would you do it? Like. When she's doing the, when she goes to do the thing, um, uh, don't nod this time. <laughs> you can look, just, you know what I mean? Like, just don't just, do anything, right? Just don't do anything. Okay. You can look at her, but yeah. So I want to just see what that looks like. All right, action. I can't wait to go to the shore this weekend. Wait, we need a grill. Yeah, yeah, I like that one. Good, all right. And Bean was in the shot or not? Yeah, she was. You were, you, were, you were the star. You were the star. Look how good she's getting. She's, she knows. She's like, oh, well, the camera's off, so I'll just rest. Wait for my next next lines. That was really good. Um, so now the next one is, this is where you can really, this is going to be where you shine, Turner. Because you get to say a lot of stuff. Mm. <laughs> 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 All right, let's say. What do we got? You want to hold her? Uh, so this one goes. I'm in the same position. No, you guys are gonna be in different clothes. Oh, so that was it. Yep, and then it's um. For that. These were comfy. I'm putting these back on. <laughs> I'm staying in them. The this rest time of the day. you say you're gonna be holding her, and you'll be like, I can't wait to to go back down. I can't wait to go back down again. What about the yard? And then you're gonna go. Uh, looks like we need a trimmer. It's a mulch, and we need some, and then it'll cut off. That sounds like it's you. not that much. That's not that many. <laughs> He's upset. Except, <laughs> except, <laughs> except, <laughs> in, except in real life, I'd be like, dude, we gotta go to the flea market, <laughs> like to get this off. Maybe. Or like to the thrift store. So to th get mulch. Oh no, you could yeah. No. You could do. You could think of anything. They like, said, wait, you mulch, said, oh, they do sell mulch. Do, yeah. um, what else? Uh, it's like... You can mulch. And that is a wrap. Bean, grab it. <laughs> All 
All right, here we go. Fresh morning here in Summers Point. All right, so about how long ago was that? Six months ago? Probably around six months ago, they imploded. half of the power plant near where we live across the bay and today they're going to do the big stack so we're about to go and hopefully get a drone shot of the implosion this has been a landmark for us our whole lives the power plant and it's gonna be gone completely soon so hopefully there's not 700 people down here but we you never know you just never know the coffee cup and the cigarette and now there's no coffee cup and soon in about 12 minutes there's gonna be no more cigarette now I was, we were just like wondering if you'd actually be able to see it from here but you know, the clearest, perfect, most perfect view of it. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't realize it was that good. So here it is. That big stack. Probably hard to say. What does your angle look like? Are you close? It's fine, not close, but it'll be a good shot. My arm's gonna run out of battery. There's no one's there. <laughs> no way I have it like contorted. You could miss it there so late. Cause like... Yeah, you could easily miss it. You'd be like, oh, they're just late. And then you just walk away for two seconds. I mean, I'm sure it's a gnarly operation. Maybe they're having issues. Like kind of shocked when it happened, but that, that was, was really a... loud. Damn! Imagine being on one of them salvage right there. Look at nice dusting. Can you go down low? You sit high. I can't get. It. I can get closer, but not really. Can you get lower? And like. Yeah, but I started to lose connection when I got too far. Did they say? Well, there's no way all these other wow. people were just missing wow. from just like the them. helicopters getting the shot though. I hear the news, probably. Yeah. They have to be taking down the big one. Why would all these people be here? Let's get it. The boy. What's the up, boy. There he is. What's up, dude? Dude, here I got you. 
What's up, man? There you go, baby. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> dude, uh, that's an actual Blockbuster card, dude. Uh, yeah. Nice, man. I found that in a wallet in storage somewhere. Oh. Wow, check this out. Blockbuster membership card. I gotta give that to my boy. APC Cool Picks. My goodness, that's Can you believe awesome. that's real? Yeah, that's real, dude. This is... I used to have this when I was younger, man. I mean, I, it's I got I someone it, else's name and yeah, stuff. Yeah, no. But. I have it somewhere in my house. I don't know where it is, though. <laughs> What's up, dude? What's up, man? You saw the explosion today? Yeah, man. I, I, got for, I got footage, too. I wasn't impressed. What? With the explosion. Yeah, I thought... I, everyone thought it was going to be, like, something bigger, like... You know, the smokestack or whatever, but I heard they ain't coming down until June. Yeah. Yeah. All right, you got this movie planned for me? Yeah. Well, actually, it's actually almost done. Wait. Oh, not. you filmed it all? Yeah, we filmed... Well, almost. I got to do... I got to go on the beach to do film my last scene. And, the, and oh, by the way, the, the demolition, that's going into the movie. Yeah, so, uh, right? Yeah. So, basically, what I have planned is that... This is actually my last... um college assignment for the semester for my video production class okay and what it is is um it's called jersey vice yeah. based off of like you know miami vice beverly hills cop those type of uh 80s cop films or whatever and um i took like an archy direction and filmed it using vhs okay like i actually filmed a good majority of the movies is like filmed in that specific uh vhs format and what's nice too is that at Stockton, unlike um, the computer I have at home, obviously, I actually have access to stuff like File Cut Pro and um, Avid. So they let you use it, obviously. Yeah. Yeah, because there's yeah, like there's also in using um, File Cut, I was able to make this. Wow, this looks good, boys. Wow. Yeah, somebody uploaded the blank version of it, and I just like had some fun with that. That's nice. Yeah. Just a paid tribute to that, you know? Hated, not agitated, but I have like these sensory overloads. So you know about the rage rooms, huh? Yeah. I, so what my idea was, right? What? Is to build a complete rage room, mm -hmm. drywall everything Yeah. in the backyard uh -huh. for Sammy. Because I heard it's good for like mental health to do yeah, it. Yeah, it is, yeah. Why don't we build one and then you can build one too? And then we'll have two rage rooms and you guys can just go in there and just... You just get like a bunch of junk and we could just smash it apart. That's what I'm saying. Like these TVs and stuff. Yeah. Stuff that I find in the trash. Yeah. And we could just set it all up like a living room and then just go in there. And you could have like a whole wall of yeah. weapons you want to use. Yeah. Would you but, do it? Yeah. As long as I have proper protection like PPE. Yeah, like a know? whole... Like a big like a mask or... Cause I know, cause I've seen it in professional like built rage rooms. They wear like all this equipment, like say, um, heavy duty jackets and masks and all that. Yeah. You know? Alex was talking about doing a rage room. What's a rage room? Where like you set every everything set up for you to break. Oh really? Yeah. You heard about go. it before? You're no. the one who told me about it. Oh, where you like break plates? No, like TVs and stuff. <laughs> oh well, anything. <laughs> So if I had a rage room, would you go to it? Yes. <laughs> My first customer, this guy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Is this scaring this you guys? What? I don't even From know. From when I was younger and full of hunger, I don't All right, drink so a lot. There's like this the mirror, crazy note. The tears of horror saying, I'm still a boy. I'm still a boy. In the shell of a monster, the devil looks at me like I'm something familiar. Familiar feeling. Well, now that I want free, so it can be as gold. The end. That's just scary. What so a this, freak wrote this. This note came in the storage unit. Can you save a dying conscious, a dying moral compass, leading into the darkness? I mutilated my mind with sin. The images swirl like a disco. I have no halo, so I won't be as bright as Apollo. I don't cut myself with blades. Just each bedroom escape escapade. Sometimes after it's done, I threw up in the toilet, writing in agony. God, just please kill me. Dude, whoever woke that ain't right in the head. <laughs> no way, right? Well, That's I'm, not even cool. That's scary. Yeah, I mean, this could literally be a suicide film. Imagine is... if that was, though. Dude, if it was, you better, you probably may want to yeah. take it to the police. I would just throw it out and just never watch it. Yeah, that's scary. Because, like, nobody needs to see that if it truly is. No, it's not. Hopefully nothing on here is, right? No. <laughs> the... No, nah, this is good. Power Rangers. Power Rangers, yep. Woo! Yep. <laughs> yep. But, yeah, this is, uh... 
the level of some people's minds and we got creepier near the end sad think about satanic yeah. worship and yeah. this one's the actual net i told him to stop reading at the end just in case he was casting a spell <laughs> and i would i would finish it just so it yeah. didn't attach That's itself true, to him though, right <laughs> i mean what if this is part of it right yeah, um, Welcome to the Thunderdome. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we found Jackie Chan, Jennifer Love Hewitt, the tuxedo. Classic movie, right? Mm -hmm. So it's a bootleg version. You can tell from the way that the cover was printed. Yeah. Second, it, there's a note inside the tape and said, no, it's not the movie The Tuxedo with Jackie Chan. I taped over it so you can convert it to DVD with your machine if you want to. I know, the guy looks like a chunky Deion Sanders. It's one of my classics, so watch not with your grandma. I made a copy of this, I hope, over the highlights of the 1996 Olympics. So secondary, they taped the 1996 Olympics highlights on the tape. And then, dun dun dun. So the movie that you thought of with me is in it, yeah, that entire movie. I just took the red scene, she stole the show. This guy's fucked. <laughs> so it's a porno basically but we we're trying to actually determine what it actually is with all of our tvs and vcrs and we uh, can't even figure out how to do it but we're not going to show it anyway i just thought that it was so ridiculous insane that it was it must be filmed and also i believe this stuff was in this storage unit since the early 90s is what it feels like or maybe in a different storage unit and then it got moved Nice mysterious questions. After all the controversy, it's literally just a bootleg version of the tuxedo. <laughs> you can see clearly that's what it is. <laughs> wow. I can't believe it. Oh, what a bummer. <laughs> it's like tinted in a way. Like, yes, we finally figured it out. This is actually, this is a bootleg tape, by the way, of tuxedo. And for one thing, the tape looks very distorted. The coloring looks way off. And you, and this is like something you could get in like, you know, New York or something. Well, and zero true. audio. Yeah. <laughs> tuxedo with no audio. It's nothing like watching a bootleg version of Tuxedo on VHS in the backyard with the boys. <laughs> In case of you guys don't know what this is, this is, um, I believe, you guys can correct me if I'm wrong here, this is basically the Japanese version of Power Rangers, and, um, and for further context, Power Rangers in Japan was known as Super Sentai, so basically it started out in Japan first before it came to America, and, uh, and yeah, this was actually recorded off television here. Because of us? Yeah. Intense. The plot thickens, boys. Alright, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back. When the actual television commercial comes out for Ace Hardware, we will hopefully be able to get a copy of it so that we can share it on our Facebook page. I'm not thinking it's going to be out, edited, and posted by the time that this video drops. If it is, I'll put it in the video, but I don't think so. Either way, that was really fun. Finn killed that. Finley Magic's first television commercial. First time her face is going to be seen only by Atlantic, or Cape May County, I should say. But we are back. We're here in the backyard. I have a little surprise for everybody, as you can see behind me, under that black sheet. If you've been watching our channel for uh, almost any amount of time, you probably can guess what this is. But let's do it. Key suspense music now. And what is it? Let's do this. Three, two, one. You guessed it. It's another electric bike. Okay, so we have this problem. And I'm not even going to call it a problem because it's not a problem at all. If anything, it's a solution. But we have a feeding frenzy on our hands. So we made promotional videos 
for electric bikes, electric skateboards, electric scooters, all different types of products. But these companies like our videos so much that we are being continuously contacted by electric bike companies to do more and more reviews. At this point, I'm almost, I'm having to turn some down because it's just too many electric bikes, too much. It's just too much. But here we are, this company sent us this bike for free. So I'm gonna give them the justice of showing it to everybody because that's the right thing to do. I gotta still attach this little light. But here it is, the Mach Wheel e-bike, check it out. So this is the Scoria model. Um, pretty easy to step over. So this could be, I know it's kind of weird how a woman's bike allows you to step in it easily and a men's bike has the bar across. I mean, for men or women, but a guy who's falling down on the bar, I don't know how much sense that makes, but that's just how it is. So I guess, this is a, a unisex bike, obviously anybody could ride it, but it does have that little curve. But here, this is my favorite part is the wood piece. It uh, just gives it a little extra flair. But I have not ridden the bike at all. I'm actually charging it right now, as you can see. And the key is ready and we are ready to rip. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take it for a ride to the fishing pier and I'll be able to get some really cool aerial shots of me riding it, I hope. This could get pretty crazy. Um, but yeah, the mock wheel. Let's do it. Let's go take this thing for a ride and I'll show you guys how epic it actually is. wanted to say I just filled the tires up but I took this for a little test run in the street the back tire was pretty flat almost flat enough to where the kickstand was hitting the ground when I was turning so my suggestion for everybody is always be aware and feel comfortable on any kind of electric bike like this this is what I would do anyway before you take it somewhere far away, like on a real ride. So really adjust everything and get it up to what you feel like it feels safe and then kind of push it more. Cause I could have just gotten smoked if I just tried to take this real quick without test riding it first. It's looking uh, pretty good though. 